one of the studies that sparked my interest, I mean, this was as a doctoral student many, many years ago, I was perusing the stacks. I feel for the doctoral students these days because you don't really do that anymore. And that's how some <laughs> right, of the yeah. amazing things happen. Was a, a, by a, a fellow named Albert Rothenberg, and he was studying creative geniuses. And he read all their journals and letters, and, and he found this bear, this fascinating pattern, which is they saw tensions as paradoxes. They saw them as opportunities. So this was Mozart and Harmony and Discord. This was Picasso and Light and Dark, uh, Virginia Woolf and Life and Death, and absolutely all the quantum physicists. They, I mean, the Tao of Physics is a phenomenal book about the paradoxes they saw with, you know, are, are particles, is it a particle or a wave in motion or at rest? But what they, you know, it brought them to the verge of madness at some times. But the point was all of these con contradictions actually ended up making richer opportunities, whether it was in the music or the arts or the sciences. And that was my big, one of my big aha moments of, wait a minute, there is something there. And in business, we are thinking far too linearly in a very complicated way.